In Kenya's Kibera Slam, an independent community football league is making a difference in more ways than one. The leaders are using football to get the youth to abandon crime and drugs. One beneficiary is 33-year-old former criminal Elijah Wambua. Before joining the league, Wambua terrorized Nairobi residents with violent robberies. Uh, football is everything to me. If I'm not for football, for now I could be uh, dead or in jail. Uh, I use football for living. It has made me to be a person in my community and a useful person in my area. Uh, yeah. The league was founded in 2019 by Eric Juma, who was inspired to start it after his childhood friend was killed while taking part in a carjacking. The fear of losing more friends to crime drove him to start the league. Interbase inter League, this is a, a, a league which is played, we normally call it an amateur league, played within a slum settlement. Basically, the league was introduced to end the uh, things to do with the crime and drugs in our society. Yeah. The participants compete according to their respective hangout sports, which are known as base in popular slang. The rules forbid the contestants from playing under the influence of drugs. A lot of people were being killed in our society and football was the only uniting factor which could unite as, as a one family. And that's normally we say that football unites and that's the only language we use to end crime in our society. A ban preventing Kenya from taking part in international football activities has been lifted after nine months. That could be great news for the East African countries aspiring footballers.